It is Alpha Kappa Alpha Day at Savannah City Hall. It's also the first day of Black Maternal Health Week, calling for reproductive justice. WSAB Sarah Smith spoke with one of the sorority's members about this issue, and she joins us now with a closer look. Well, according to the CDC, black women are three times more likely to die from pregnancy related causes than white women. Multiple factors contribute to this. Kim Dubois is one of the members of the Gamma Sigma Omega chapter of AKA, and she says black women need to be listened to when they say something isn't feeling right with their pregnancy. You could lose your life doing the most natural thing that women can do. Giving birth is a beautiful thing and an exciting time for many women. But there is an ongoing crisis in the black community. Thousands of women dying from pregnancy related complications. Kim Dubois is a member of Gamma Sigma Omega chapter of Alpha Kappa Alpha. The sorority is using AKA Day at Savannah City Hall to turn people's attention to this heartbreaking issue. Many talked about the fact that they experienced that and just sort of put it behind them and just as women typically do, just moved forward. Um, but it is, it is a serious issue and they felt very just lucky to have escaped and to have survived. According to the CDC, factors which cause this include variation in quality health care, underlying chronic conditions, structural racism, and implicit bias. Those disparities are really unacceptable. The chapter is calling for action from doctors to listen to women when they are concerned or worried about their health during a pregnancy. Action from lawmakers to move forward with the Momnibus Act, which would fund local organizations which already protect mothers of color. This act hasn't moved forward since 2021, as Georgia's number of pregnancy-related deaths continue to rise. They are also calling for action from the community to never drop this conversation. There has to be accountability. There has to be a commitment. Um, the problem won't go away on its own. We have to, we have to work at it, and we have to, um, again, policy, evidence-based policy solutions are the only way. And of course, awareness and education advocacy. Mm -hmm. Black Maternal Health Week is going on now until April 17th. To learn more about this issue, visit WSAV.com slash Black Maternal Health. Sarah Smith, WSAV News 3, on your side.